You have been given a beautiful girl as a wife. You have been given a beautiful girl as a sister. You have been given a beautiful lady as a mother. Inside that mother, you find a beautiful girl. You find a beautiful lover. In that loving, you understand a beautiful mother, a grandmother. If you understand that one, then tomorrow when you have a girl as a wife, What is Buddha? What is you? What is your family? Drop it from the mind and look into you. And once you understand that one, you can love your mother and father. You have been given a beautiful girl as a wife. You have been given a beautiful girl as a sister. You have been given a beautiful lady as a mother. Inside that mother, you find a beautiful girl. You find a beautiful lover. In that loving, you understand a beautiful mother, a grandmother. If you understand that one, then tomorrow when you have a girl as a wife, you understand the whole world because yin and the yang, positive and negative, only can create electricity. You understand that you and her love can give a birth to a new child, to a new invention. Yes. And that invention, you do not have to hold it. You keep it open, it stays, if you hold it, it runs away. It breaks you down, mentally, physically. That's why nowadays, when the girls go to the, for delivery, they need cesarean. My grandmother used to, used to tell me that when she was climbing the tree, the baby came out. Such was the beauty experience, an orgasmic experience of the baby. Because they were not holding on, they were not concentrating on the baby, they were concentrating on their strength of doing the work non-stop. That becomes a stretching exercise. What is Buddha? What is your religion? What is your caste? What is your nationality? All that keeps on disturbing you. What is your qualification? This mind is not my qualification. This mind is not Buddha. This mind is not my religion. This mind is not my caste. All these are trying to trap me. But it is not a trap. Once you understand your energy, utilize energy, then religion becomes beautiful. Because religion is not to get frightened. You love the religion. Then the uh, temples, masjid, then Churches becomes a lover's place, not a place to fear that God is, I am a God-fearing <coughs> person. You do not have to use the term God-fearing, God is loving. What is Buddha? This mind is not Buddha.